Hello everyone, this is Dino Don again uh, with a little update to my project. I'm on a forum and I had a posted a question about my video and uh, seeing my AC signal on the scope. And one of the members on there goes by RIS, R I S, said uh, try putting a diode, take the diode out and put it in the just before the cell. So so what I did is I took, here's my blocking diode, and I took and added a second diode in the same configuration coming from the negative side of the cell. And this is what I came up with. <clears throat> Alright, I've already got this tuned in for resonance. Notice where the trace line is. Notice how all the pulses are pretty much 90% above the zero reference line, meaning that they're positive pulses. Now my scope is still attached to the positive side of the cell. And the divisions on the cell uh, scope are still at 2 volts per division with a times 100 probe. So we're looking at about 800 volts. And I'm still at uh, 0.6 amps, 8.1 volts. Now, if I turn on my gating, <clears throat> reselect my switch, and that's what I come up with. Let me put a freeze on this and see if I can, there we go. And that's the waveform I am now seeing. All positive pulses with a little bit of a dip into the negative. But, nonetheless, that's pretty, in, pretty interesting. And you can see as I adjust my frequency generator, primary frequency is the voltage down until I hit peak voltage of roughly 800 volts. And I also have a gating control here where I can increase the, decrease the gating, increase the gating. So, that's what I'm at. So, looks a little better than before. Now, if it actually means anything, I don't know. Uh, still, again, no production, uh, which I'm not too concerned about because in Meyer's videos and in all his patents and water fuel cell tech brief, he states that at a thousand volts the water molecule starts to elongate. So that means you're not going to see gas production with high voltage until you are over a thousand volts. So right now that's only about 800 volts. Uh, I'm only putting 8 volts in. So if I can't Right now, I don't think I can go higher than 8 volts without uh, my circuit going into lockup or something. Uh, but anyway, thought I'd just post that, see what you guys think. Alright, thanks for watching.